What's good, YouTube, man? As you can tell right here, man, we have Mr. Beast, bro. As you already know, bro, he comes with A1 content every video, bro. It don't matter if that nigga's doing a fucking... It, it don't matter, bro. Any video he does is like a W, you feel me? So let's get straight to it, man. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you smash the subscribe button, bro. If you have not already subscribed, bro, if you have, I appreciate you so much, bro. Honestly. But let's get straight to it. Like I said, if you enjoyed this, make sure you smash the subscribe button. It's Christmas, bro. Don't you want to spread joy, bro? Like, spread joy. You subscribing to me? Well, spread joy. Let's get to it. You $10,000 in a grocery cart. That's wild, dude. Let's yes. go. Well, I'll give it to you in 24 hours. Oh, okay. This challenge could... I just bought this entire grocery store, which includes enough food to literally feed an entire city. And then I decided to trap this random guy inside. And every day you live here, I will give you $10,000 in a grocery cart. That's wild, dude. Let's yes. go. Well, I'll give it to you in 24 hours. Oh, okay. This challenge could literally make Alex a multi-millionaire, which in theory means he could be in here for years. And it starts right now. All right. Bro, I was literally, I'm not gonna lie, bro. I'd stay in that grocery store for a year. Bro, a lot of y'all may not believe me, bro. But I'd stay in that grocery store for a year. I, matter of fact, nigga, forget a year. I would stay in that grocery store until I have no more food, bro. Dead ass, bro. I would stay in that motherfucker until I have no more food, bro. Bro, nigga. You get ten thousand dollars a day, nigga. Just, just act like you just. You know what I turn? You know what I do? I turn like the back room into like my bedroom, nigga. Like TV. I get, I get in my fucking game, nigga. You good to go, bro? I get on that motherfucking, that motherfucking Wi-Fi. Why I go, but, bro? I stay in that bitch until I have no more food, bro. Dead ass, bro. That's probably. I don't know how long a, a, a grocery store could stay like stocked with one person eating. I'm not sure. I know a lot of stuff would probably expire though. And you'd probably get tired of eating the same shit. But I mean, it's $10,000 a day. If this nigga don't at least stay in there, I'm not gonna lie, bro. If he don't at least stay in that bitch for 100 days, bro, that's 100,000. If you don't stay in that bitch for 100 days, you gotta be probably. The dumbest nigga I know. I'm not going to hold you, bro. Well, that I've seen. I don't know you, but. $10,000 a day, bro. Let's get to the video, bro. Holy shit. Jimmy's gone. Why would I ever leave? I could be here for years. Time to go grocery shopping, baby. Now, if Alex crosses this red line that we painted around the entire perimeter of the grocery store, the challenge is over and he walks away with his current winnings. And to make sure he stays inside, it's worth noting here that we have countless cameras covering every square inch of the grocery store. For my first meal on night one, I guess I'll cook the steak. I think this is just gonna be home base, this little corner of the grocery store. If I have meals like this every night, I'll easily be here for years. Day one complete. See you in the morning. It has officially been 24 hours and I got the first 10 grand. Bro, Alex! That is hey! Insane. Do you feel this and confirm it's $10,000? Um, it is. It I is. believe you. Now we introduce the twist of the challenge. Basically, to receive the daily $10,000, you need to give me $10,000 in product from the store. And so you have to strategize what order to get rid of these items to stay here as long as possible. Whoa. Oh, wow. Okay. Conveniently, okay. there's a lot of electronics over there that are pretty expensive for day one. That's probably a good idea. You can't really eat a TV, so it's no use. Bro, set it, bro. To me. You're 22 cents over. All right, let me check out. Do you have an MVP card? No. Would you like one? No. Do you want to sign up no. for Here's your cash. Chris, take it away. Beep, beep, beep. I will see you tomorrow with another $10,000 in cash. You should start strategizing what you're going to sell me. This changes everything. I got to start strategizing for the future. I have to figure out all of the stuff that I need to get rid of. This Pet is crazy. Are you, wait. Yo, bro, bro, you a fan of GTA? Yes. But five? Because they released the GTA 6 trailer on YouTube. So... So, yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> what, you, <laughs> what did you say what the fuck for, bro? <laughs> hey, what did you say? <laughs> what did you say what the fuck for? 
Go watch it on Rockstar. I'll watch it after this video, bro, bro. If you... Not so much money. Wait, not much money. Bags. I'm, do, I'm stupid. Oh, no, I just said it. MB. My bad. <laughs> nah, you good, buddy. But after this video, I got you, though, bro, bro. I want to see that bitch, that ass. Pet food, pet items. Jimmy cannot pay me to eat this stuff. I swear. I got $10,000 worth of dog food right here. I think I'm just going to get some rest. W. Wake up early. It's a W. Because I'm going to have to prep more it's items a w. tomorrow. Wait, what the fuck? Twenty six, twenty six days and three hours. It's not bad, buddy. It's not bad right there. I got a lot of work ahead of me. Day three, man. Alex, That's what's up, Thirty thousand right there, bro. Is that what you're selling to me today? Today, it's dog food. Oh my gosh, this is gonna take us forever to move. Wait, can we do like a? I let him clap transition. Go for it. There we go. No, it's, it's all over oh. here at the register. Isn't that a cool effect? I love beast magic. We're at $9,991.80. And for the final item, we are now at $10,045. And something you should know. Every single item Alex sells to me, we are literally going to donate to charity. So don't worry, none of this is going to go to waste. The next few days were kind of a breeze for Alex. On day five, he sold me $10,000 worth of produce. All this produce here, they're going to go bad very fast. On day six, he sold me a bunch of diapers. And on day seven, eight, and nine, he cleared out an additional $30,000 worth of products. He even discovered the back room of the store. And since he hasn't showered in 10 days, he built his very own makeshift shower. Um, and laundry system. Rub a dub dub. Hey, how's it going? Oh, What's yeah. Up, Bro, locked in. Jimmy? All right, as of now, give me an honest answer. How far do you think you're going to go? Oh, I mean, I feel like 100 days for sure. Oh, boy. Depending on how long Alex lasts, this may just become my most expensive video ever. But I'm prepared for that. Money, money, money Holy all the time. crap, dude. I don't care if you go a year. I got the money. Who put all this in here is what I want to know. The bank. You will get this once I get my $10,000 in items. All right, today I have more TVs. Who goes to a grocery store to buy a TV? Why are these here? <laughs> now, Alex, be honest with me. Did you empty out any of these TV boxes, fill them with rocks, and keep the TV? Uh, dogs. All right, I trust them. What? Though, that was not what I was asking. <laughs> Approaching day 11, Alex began to get pretty efficient at picking which items to sell. $10,001.89. And since I had to leave to go film a video where I stranded myself on an island, this is not comfortable, but let's pray we get like 30 minutes of sleep tonight. We had someone else drop oh, off the money for Alex. We call it. him the money man. Oh, it's the money man. Thank you, sir. $100,000. I could definitely reach a million. And what he did with the rest of his time to keep himself entertained was interesting. I am building a cheese ball wall. <laughs> it's done. The great wall of cheese balls. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. Here we go. Three, two, one. Whoa. It was worth it. Living that motherfucker, bro. It was so worth it. On day 13, Alex decided to upgrade his shower because it's No, I might just be the dumbest nigga I know. A piece of crap! What I'm gonna do is use four of these shelves to reinforce the shower. Okay, here we go. Ah! I'm gonna use plastic liner. Drape it across here. The walls are waterproof now. All right, you gotta give it to him. This man is literally constructing a functioning shower out of just raw store parts. Damn, there it is. Shower's done. Time to test it. Okay, it's been a few days in here. I'm gonna build a wall. Now, I never thought I'd see this, but Alex literally used all the water bottles in the entire store to build walls for his makeshift shelter. He even created a bed using all of the toilet paper, and it looked kind of comfortable. This is pretty cozy. I fall asleep right here. This nigga got it, bruh. It was kind of comfy, though. I gotta get the scan in. Kinda had my eyes on these bad boys for a while. 
gift cards. These things are freaking expensive. It is actually surprising how expensive birthday cards are because Alex was able to hit his $10,000 mark only using the cards. And after I got back from filming at the island, oh, hey, 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 it's been a while. Alex wanted to see if we could help him use the forklift in the back of the store. You know, if you could get it in the store, that'd be super helpful. You're sure you're gonna let Chris drive this? Yeah. Three, two, three. All right. Not the bakery! Oh! Hey, it's in! Yes! Yeah! 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 Enjoy your forklift. We'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Even though it's only been a day since he last saw me, it seemed like Alex really started to miss me. At least, that's the only explanation I have for what he's about to do. I saw this cut out of Jimmy over here. We're gonna be hanging out a lot, you and I. He's just gonna watch, make sure I don't lose count. Just scanning away for another 10K. $10,000, cents. Over the next few days, Alex's efficiency was through the roof thanks to his new forklift. So he even had enough time to upgrade his bed. And it was quite the improvement. This is so much better. And even though Alex's original goal was to get a million dollars, I think we're going for a mil on this one. I hope not. He started documenting what he'd spend the money on and came to realize maybe he didn't need to stay as long as he thought. A million dollars is nice in theory. I'm still missing out time with my boys. Both their birthdays are coming up in the next two months. I've never missed a birthday yet. So after thinking about what I want to put the W toward, family, I realized that I need W. I like that, bro. That's, that's the W, bro. At least make $500,000. But right now, I only have 200. So in total, I got 50 days I gotta be in here. Almost halfway there. On day 22, Alex decided to absolutely decimate all the goldfish in the grocery store. Oh my God. Okay, so this is $10,000 worth of goldfish. I could feed an army of toddlers. All right, thank you, sir. You're living a regular life now. Almost. You're getting paid 10 grand a day to miss your family. Yeah. yeah. And you can just do this however long you want. Yeah. And you can just do this however long you want. That's crazy. Nah, I'd miss my family though. As you can see, the days started blending together for Alex. <laughs> But eventually, the day came where he decided to sell the water that he originally used for his shelter. But since he couldn't sell the empty shelves in the store, he realized they make pretty good walls. I'm gonna reinforce the house with metal shelves. This is the way. As you can see, Alex is feeling pretty at home now. But what he doesn't know is when I bought this grocery store, I stopped paying the electricity bill. So at any point now, all the power's gonna cut off and his freezers won't work, the lights won't work, and so much more. The challenge is gonna get way harder. But to give him some motivation before things get pretty crazy. We thought Damn. Alex deserved a reward. Are you excited to see that? That's a W. Yeah. You ready That's to do w. this? Yeah. I think he might literally cry. This is gonna be crazy. W Mr. Beast, bro. Hey, Alex, we have a surprise for you. Hello. We brought oh, some special baby. guests. Hi, buddy. Yesterday, you were telling me about how much you miss your family, and I felt kind of bad. So to celebrate 30 days, we're going to let you spend the day with them. Is that Daddy? Daddy. Uh, I need to go pee. <laughs> <laughs> What's happening with all the boxes on the floor? I made a race car track. Oh, is that the car? <laughs> yeah. Wait, can he ride that? <laughs> what do you think, dude? <laughs> Today I got to see Sarah and the boys. It was freaking amazing. And Sarah was as beautiful as ever. I love you. Bye, buddy. I love you. Heart break. When I saw my kids, I mean, they like looked different to me. You know, at that age, they grow weekly. I just look forward to going back home, spending time with my family. You got 20 more days, bro. You got this, bro. Lock What's in. What's up? I better Lock get in, up bro. and start scanning stuff now. We're gonna... What the heck? Why are the lights off? What are these shenanigans? Where's my flashlight? Is this some kind of joke? Houston, we have a problem. Did you do this, sir? <laughs> knock, knock. Oh, wow. This is so much creepier. My power's out, Jimmy. Yes. So when I bought this grocery store, they gave me a form to put like the utilities in my name, and I just never filled it out. 
The cameras and cash registers are hooked up to a generator because we need those. So what am I looking at over here? Okay, so I had originally $60,000 ready to go. Oh my gosh. But I assume now that the power went out, you're gonna sell the frozen stuff. Yeah. Things have changed. We need to get to scan it. Let's get rid of these hot meats. Assembly line. All right, I'll hold the cart. Assembly line. I'm the door holder. And while they're clearing out the freezers, I want to tell you guys about Shopify. Shopify helped pay for this grocery store and in exchange wanted me to promote one of the millions of businesses they support in power. If only we had a bag that we could put these things in to keep it cold. And together we picked Kanga coolers. Chandler, what if I told you there's a 12-pack of soda inside of it? Whoa. And it can keep what's inside cold up to seven hours. That's, That's a long forever. time. You got multi wieners, you got single wieners. Cheesy. Cheesy wieners. Kanga coolers are lightweight and insulated, so you can take them wherever. Hey, meet us at the front. Chandler, have you ever been a cashier Go. before? Go. Wait, you double scan that. Hold up, you can have the Kanga cooler. You can fit a human head in here. Anyways, click the link in the description down on the shop app right now. You can buy a Kanga cooler, and I'm gonna go help them scan some meat. All right, yeah, here's bug. our meat receipt. <laughs> Here's your 10 grand. Also, here's a Kanga cooler. Oh, nice. Oh, by the way, Alex, I'm going to Africa for a week. At this point, I once again had to leave to go film a video in Africa where I built 100 wells. Well, everyone, is this video right there, that video. If you didn't watch that, it's on my page, go watch that. And the rest of his day rushing to get all the frozen food sold so it could be donated. Because I'll just be scanning stuff in the dark from now on. We really hope Jimmy turns the power on. It's gonna suck. I'm not gonna lie, being left without power affected Alex way more than I thought it would. I guess the food wasn't the only thing getting checked out. Ah. What if you can tip over a forklift? Oh. Careful on aisle seven. Ah. Ooh. This door is turning into a wasteland. So I'm going to the back. I'm gonna open up this dock door and let some daylight hit my face. Breathe in some fresh air, cause this is not gonna do it. My face, breathe in some fresh air, cause this is I didn't mean to replay that, my fault. I hit the keyboard. Oh, it's so nice. This right here will get me through the dark days. It is day 36. I got $360,000. Why stop now? Gotta keep loading these carts up. Got a lot of food to get through. Just carts and pools of money and waiting, waiting for the days to go by. The most exciting part of my day is being this close to the red line. I'm just a sad old miserable boy back here. Nothing's ever been sadder in my life. <laughs> Living in a grocery store, coffee, food, and a lot of money. I'm like way ahead on checkouts still. I don't want to do anything. There's nothing to do. All that stands between me, my wife, my kids, is this line right here. Lights being off, being this close to the red line, realizing I can go see my family. It's super tempting every day now. Mm. I know there's a bunch of pallets back there. Well, your ass crossed that line, you're done! Glasses, ice packs. Oh, what the? <laughs> Look what I just found. Insta Start Quick Pack Lantern. Nice. I got five of them. I just lit them all up. They're on full blast right now. It definitely lights up the entire space really well. I feel like I can actually like hang out in here again. Oh, Alex, are you here? Yo! Another 10K? Yeah. Let's go, dude. It's crazy I have all this money, but there's nothing I can do with this money while I'm in here, except just look at it. Well, you can't look at it because it's so dark in here. <laughs> so I'm gonna bring some lights in. Are you serious? For filming purposes. All right. What are you gonna do for the rest of the time you're in here? Something I definitely wanna do is go ahead and just run through all these shells with the forklift. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You asked for this. What is going on? All right, time for me to not be here anymore. We'll see you tomorrow. Here's your broom. Thanks, guys. Enjoy cleaning. After spending an entire day cleaning up Chris's mess, Alice took advantage of the newly opened space to set up a pool he found in the back. Off we go. <laughs> I'm gonna drag the hose bro, out here, I was stick it in this store, pool. And sometime bro. tomorrow, we'll have a grocery swimming pool. It's been over a week and Chandler won't tell me what happened while I was gone. This place looks completely different. Oh God, open the doors, I gotta see this. 
Whoa! Where did everything go? We uh, did a little remodeling while you were gone. This looks like someone gave Chris a forklift. Everything makes sense now. Can you show me the pool? Yeah, you want to get in? Did you wear a sock? Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> oh, it's freezing. Get him off! What do you typically do in the pool? I just kind of float around. This was fun and all, but I think we should check out. <laughs> Thanks for the groceries. Enjoy your pool. All right, I'm just gonna grab everything from the back and just put it up here, organize it, and who knows, maybe there's something fun in there. It's no secret at this point, Alex was pretty tired. And while he was making his rounds in the forklift, something unexpected happened. Oh, what? God. I was trying to turn one way and it just went the opposite direction. Oh my God. My freaking money is soaked. There's a bunch of product ruined. It's like so deep right here. It's in my space. It's all over the grocery store. Dude, I'm done, man. I just want to leave. We're going in. Bro, you can't leave, Alex. bro. Buddy. Why is it so wet in here? Yeah, ill. Yo. Oh, Alex. Your golden chariot awaits you. <laughs> oh, look at you in bed. You good, dog? I'm all right, man. You look like a defeated man. Yeah, I busted the pool. I just wanted to bust a pool. So I was driving by to drop off some pallets, and I tried to turn, and it just turned the complete opposite way. And I was like, no! So all this got wet. How many more weeks do you have left? Weeks? <laughs> I'm just kind of taking it day by day right now. It depends how much longer I can go. So if you just see like a spider in your bed tomorrow, you're, you're leaving? Oh, 100%. <laughs> I don't think he has many days left. This is ending soon. You guys want to come hang out for a little bit? Heck no. You're depressing. This is what the store looked like when Alex started the challenge. And this is what it looks like now. You got it, bro. So, you got it, bro. Day 44. You got it, bro. Don't give up, bro. It's almost dark Never back outside. down, never what? Jimmy hasn't never come by yeah. today. I have stuff I need to sell. I'm just gonna move this stuff to the back. Hopefully somebody brings me the $10,000 today. Maybe they just forgot or something. It's really lonely in here. I'm just gonna, I guess, sit in my chair till they bring me some money. Damn. Yo, what? Are you serious? Are you there, Jimmy? This is the Aww. first interaction I get all day, and it's the freaking robot. Damn. Thanks for the money. Not even Jimmy wants to come here for a minute. That's how depressing this place is now. Can't say I blame him, honestly. This sucks, man. You got it, bro. Come on, bro. Six more days, bro. Six more days, bro. Five more, bro. Let's do it. Come on, bro. I believe in you. Freaking miss my family so it's all right, bro. You got it's it, bro. It's day 45, and Chandler, how would you say he's doing? That is complete boredom. He's just tapping the bat on the ground. I would feel bad for him, except he's won $450,000. Yeah. And he can leave whenever he wants. So yeah. he'll be fine. <laughs> Alex. Hey, they gotta you're stay. watching I'll on stay, the cameras. Bro. I would stay in that bitch for a year, bro. I would stay in that motherfucker for a year, bro. He looked very sad. Yeah, I'm pretty bored. Well, here's $10,000. So are you less bored? Helps a little. How many weeks left you got? I don't even know if I got an hour left, Jimmy. <laughs> oh, really? Here, let's go look at your sea of money over here. This is all the money you've made so far. 450 grand. Are you saying you're con- Bro, bro, Jimmy, bro, you gotta be like, bro, if you wanna leave right now, bro, I'll throw an extra 50,000 in, bro. Then he's good, bro. And with it? <sighs> Give me one second. I've got a surprise that might help you decide. What? Are you serious? <laughs> hey, babe. Don't cry. I didn't open. Why are your shoes? 
<laughs> to be clear, I didn't take his shoes. I don't know why he's not wearing shoes. These are all the things that this money's gonna go toward. Isn't this crazy? I can't even wrap my head around it. I feel like I could do another five days. Do you think it's worth it? What's the verdict? We've weighed the options. Make tons of money. Keep Let's go. tons of money. You already go made. Home, bro. Honestly, I'll be, I'll it's just go not home, worth bro. staying in any yeah. longer. Okay. Well, then let's push the money out. Alex, the second you video, step bro. on the red, it's over. I can move all the money back and we can keep going. It's your decision. All right, bring it back in. Okay, bring it back in. <laughs> Just kidding. Ah! Oh! Yes! Alex spent 45 days in the store and walked away with $450,000. Bro, Mr. Beast, please come give me a challenge, bro. Any challenge you got, bro, I will do it, bro. Any challenge you got, bro. Any nigga, just pull up, bro. Tap, bro, bro, nigga, nigga, nigga. Hit me on Twitter, bro. Ken's diff on Twitter. I'm telling you, bro. I'm Can't locked. Can't believe this happened. This is freaking sick. Congratulations, Alex. Shout out to Albertson for helping us fill the shelves. You guys were amazing. I'm gonna go find his shirt. Also, if you're wondering how we filmed this video because we blew up the Earth earlier, it was actually on the moon the entire time. Watch the laser maze video if that's confusing. Nah, this nigga got it with the blowing up. Now that's tough. Bro, that's a W fucking video, bro. Imagine someone come to you and says, nigga, I'll give you $10,000 for every day you can stay in this grocery store, bro. bro I, pro I, I promise you, I would at least stay in that motherfucker. I don't know why... At the beginning of the video, nigga, I know I added it up wrong, nigga. I was doing a thousand instead of ten, bro. But it's cool though. It's cool. If you want to say I'm a dumbass, you can say I'm a dumbass, nigga. I figured it out. That's why I paused the video and was like, I'm dumb as fuck. Cause you feel me? But it's cool though. It's cool. But bro, I would stay in that bitch, bro, for at least a year, bro. I would have stayed in that bitch for at least a year, nigga. Like nigga, nigga, you think four hundred and fifty thousand is a, is enough, bro? You realize how much money you spend on a kid after, like, once they turn eighteen, bro? Well, let's just think about how much money you spend on a kid until they turn eighteen, nigga. Let's matter of fact, let's search that up. I want to just break some shit down to y'all right quick. Let's let's just Google this right quick. Let's Google how much money. How much? Bro, can I type right, bro? Is spent on a kid. I don't know how to word it. Since they was born. How much money is spent on a kid? How about that? Just, just search that. Okay, raising a child from birth to age 18 now costs an average of $237,000, bro. That's just until they're 18. And then when they're 18, you're going to spend. <sighs> Bro. Bro, that is insane. That is insane. In 2023, 15,000, bro. Up to 17,000 per year, bro. On your kid, bro. And then you just and then if you want to send them to college, um, let's just search up how much. Is this yearly? Wait, per year. Let's search up per year. Okay, this is per year. So, bro, I'm in Georgia. So, in-state tuition is $8,000 per year. Bro, I would have stayed in that bitch for at least a year, bro. I promise you, I would have stayed in that grocery store for at least a year, bro. I promise you, bro. Comment down below, bro. How long would you stay in that grocery store, bro? $10,000 every 24 hours, bro. Bro, I would have stayed, bro. 
I would have been so like locked in, bro. Nigga, they would have bought ten more thousand, ten thousand, bro. I wouldn't even have been happy, bro. Job not done. <laughs> Job not done. Nigga, until I reach half of a year, then 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 I would start being happy when you're bringing in money, bro. Half of a year, good. <laughs> okay, bring some more. <laughs> Next day, let's get it. Bernardo, comment below how long would you stay in that grocery store, bro? Other than that, if y'all folks enjoyed that, bro, make sure you smash the subscribe button, bro. Tap that bell button if you'd like to. Other than that, y'all folks, stay blessed, stay grinding, keep faith that whatever you want to achieve in your life, I promise you, you can achieve it, bro. Till next video. Yeah.